but not least I went with it. Not because I saw a ton of videos here on YouTube about how great it was or that I hit the blog spots and got good reports too. You know, with its competition being a lot of different other brands that are supposed to be better, but I don't know. I just felt good about you know, that and their eBay store, current eBay store had it up there for 90 bucks because they were being discontinued. So I went on and snatched it up. And I'm cheap. So. Okay, let's see how quick I can do this and accurate I can do this in one take without no editing. How about that? So, if you're just joining me, please go back and check like the first few videos I did. Um, shout out to all the different um, channels who inspired me to start filming my journey, getting back into the saltwater game. Um, about a month ago, I posted the first video of me starting up this Fluvo Evo. So please go back and look at the, they're really short. So um, check out the first two or three, I think it is. And this will be the fourth, I believe, update. And this is after a month. So what I had said initially, even if I didn't say it in the video, is I want to see how long I could go with the stop top and light of the that comes with it because so many people in their videos had still had uh, uh, stock equipment hadn't uh, changed anything and their corals look great by this being my first time with corals and not just fish um i wanted to try it like they did you know with the stock but um all i end up ordering one the current I saw that a lot of videos on that, nothing but positive blogs, positive reviews. People have went from the stock to this and a couple of other different brand options, whatever. But I, I like the current. I did. Honestly, it looks pretty. It looks pretty. But anyway, and I also went with, so I went with the current Orbit Pro. And I went with the top change, of, of, of course. Um, the Innovative Marine Pro Series Protection Screen. Again, I showed that in the beginning. But basically what I want to tell you all, if you're thinking about it and decided, it's not that difficult to do. I just was rushing. So everything still looks kind of sloppy right here because I haven't cleaned up good enough and wiped the screen off like I want to. But check this out. The main thing you might want to remember is with that screen, measuring properly so that because you want these tabs to do what they're good for which is dropping right on the edge and you can put it in it sits flush and it looks great front and back and then um i tell you um i'm happy with it i could have did it neater the screen could be near but you know again i rushed but i'm happy with it uh so the light is coming in more this little guy already just a you know a hot second with the new light it's opened up even more and i didn't think that was even possible that quick but it's opened up even more so i like that um i still have the Ak akamai wave maker on it um it's, so it's literally blowing over there um uh, all of the frags that i had posted in the other video are pretty much they're still alive they are not as perky, but right now, I shit you not, <laughs> since this light has been on, they've perked up a little bit. And that's that's not a long time for a light to be on. Even this guy here on the side, look at that. Now, honestly, don't, wow, it never looked like that. That's crazy. So anyway, let me go around the other side, because I don't want to. You all to miss. You yeah, excuse me, I gotta walk around this bar. It's ridiculous. I should have made a YouTube video for me building this bar. You all would have had fun laughing at my ass. But anyway, um, let's see. Yeah, 
at that. That's opened up more too. It's not opened up more, but it looks uh, juicier or something. I don't want to swole. I'm currently waiting for some additives, including some Reveroids and some other stuff that I wanted to start dosing with. So, um, y'all stay tuned for the next video because that's probably the next one I'll do once I hit it with some some of the good stuff and get them all roared up. You know, the roids are good for you and make, make your muscles strong. So, yeah, I'll do the next video on that. But I have to say, honestly, a month probably wasn't uh, fair for the flu. But I noticed with everybody, they just they want to try something new. All you do it is suffer. You do it, it yourself first. Do it yourself first. <laughs> like to make upgrades even to stuff that seems like it's um pretty decent um the fish are still looking um pretty decent none of them have died uh or look sick or anything so it's just the rash the scrimp and that one little damsel who I used to he's hiding in there trying to be funny dick he trying to be funny. He don't be funny. He's high. He don't like being on social media. He has some of these balances. But get beside yourself. But anyway, um, I will keep you all posted. Please comment below. If you coming across this video and you haven't seen any of the other ones, subscribe. Go check out the first ones. Keep in mind that even though I'm right now, I'm excited about getting back into the salt water game and possibly doing several other tanks that will not be the only videos i'll be uploading to this channel as you see it's my company's um channel kae official channel so everything we do at kings of Dome entertainment i will be kind of putting pg-13 rated versions here up on youtube as well as other stuff that i personally like again like these tanks uh, we might do more pawn stuff out back as well and everything that I do that I think other people have similar in common that we can share info and stuff so be sure to subscribe click that button tell your people to do so too because we're gonna have some fun and and I'm not gonna lie to you I have one more surprise coming up I'm just gonna wait though because I don't I might change my mind in between. But I thank you all for watching this video. Mash that like button, all that good stuff, and comment below. And much love to all the reefers out there.